different forms of mercury. You've got methyl mercury coming from fish and you have inorganic mercury coming from your dental amalgams. Your dental amalgams are metallic mercury and one, they're rusting a little bit and you're swallowing that. It's going through your GI and it's blocking liver GI pathways and in, in impeding detoxification. But the other form, the vapor is coming off of it and you're inhaling that right into the blood and it circulates around. It can go wherever it wants, go into the brain, go into the joints, and then it rusts and sticks into this inorganic mercury form and sticks in. And at a cellular level, it's much more toxic than methylmercury. Methylmercury, just its problem is it's highly bioavailable and it gets across the blood brain barrier. And you see with the Tony Robbins case, that was distinctly a methylmercury exposure. If you look around the globe, the real risk is the elemental mercury in the dental amalgams becoming inorganic mercury. That's through dentistry all across the world. And it's actually getting banned in all kinds of countries. 